one of the biggest racing weekends of the year. Highlighted, of course, by simulcasting of the Kentucky Derby on Saturday afternoon here at Los Alamitos. All gates at Los Alamitos will open at 7 a.m. on Kentucky Derby Day. And we invite you to visit the beautiful Vessels Club to enjoy the racing action from across the country. As it was the case last year with California Chrome, Los Alamitos has connections to this year's Kentucky Derby. Dorman, who will start from post number eight and is the three to one second choice on the Kentucky Derby morning line, won the Los Alamitos Futurity here last December. Firing Line, who ran second in the Los Alamitos Futurity, will start from post number 10 in the Kentucky Derby and is 12 to one on the morning line. It's a busy weekend of live racing at Los Alamitos as well, starting with Friday's eight race program. The car will feature one of the most promising two-year-old fillies on the grounds, as a political dasher will make her debut in race number two. Owned by Rancho El Cabresto, a political dasher posted the fastest of 47 drills on April 18th when covering the 220 yards in 12:10 from the outside post. Saturday's feature event is the running of the $25,000 Kawiya Bar Handicap at 350 yards, featuring the champion Moonist. A winner of 11 of his last 12 stars, Muniz won the Catella Handicap by three-quarter lengths in his last outing and is coming off a great year in which he became the first horse to win four derbies at Los Alamitos. Trained by John Cooper for owners Ron and Gerald Harley, Muniz has won 15 of 23 career stars with over half a million dollars in earnings. Muniz will face a field headed by Christmas Invitational winner Jay Gold BR, who ran third to Muniz's second place finish in the Grade 1 Los Alamitos Winter Championship on February 15th. Multiple Grade 1 winner Farniente, the winner of the Vessels Maturity last year, will also be in action in one of the toughest fields to the Cahuilla Bar in quite some time. Sunday's racing program will be headed by trials to the Grade 2 Kindergarten Futurity, the season's first major Futurity at Los Alamitos. The Kindergarten will feature a cast of outstanding juveniles, including E.G. High Desert Farms' Walk Through Cristal. A winner in her debut by one and a half lengths in the season's fastest 300-yard time by a two-year-old of 15.37 on April the 10th. Others in action in the trials will be Jaime Gomez' Dog's Best Car, owner of an impressive three-quarter length main victory on April 18th, and Bobby Cox's Carnegie Hall, an easy three-quarter length winner on April the 10th. The 10 freshman runners with the fastest times on Sunday night will move on to the kindergarten final to be held on Sunday, May 17th. A great weekend of racing is on tap. And remember, all gates open at 7 a.m. on Saturday for simulcasting of the Kentucky Derby.